Hi, this is Piotr Walczyszyn, Adobe Developer Evangelist. Uh, so this is uh, my first episode from the series I called uh, Piotr on the Edge, where I'll be covering everything around Adobe Edge tools and services. Uh, so for the start, I took a topic I didn't find really a good um, explanation on the web. So how to animate um, elements with Edge Animate, of course, over a curved path. So it's not a straight line going e either direction. So let's take a look at this. Let's create a new project first. And my idea to show you how to do it uh, is to create some sort of a bouncing ball effect. So we want to bounce it over some curved path into the stage and bounce back uh, to the other side of the stage. All right, so let's draw something that will be our ball uh, in this case. And with having it selected, we want to create a couple of keyframes for it at the very beginning of our animation. So first one for the transform origin, then for the rotation, and then also for left and top, so it, uh, those uh, values stay locked uh, with the keyframe at the very beginning. Now we can turn on the pin tool. Uh, well, before we do that, sorry, we have to turn on the transform tool first, and of course change our uh, transform origin to be maybe uh, somewhere in the bottom uh, left corner of our stage. So now if we turn on the pin tool and we maybe select like one second of our animation, we can nicely, as you can see now, animate over a curved path. So we just animated that. If I play this, you can see this ball is not going straight line, it goes over a curved path. Now, if I want to bounce back into the other direction then, uh, what I need to do, first of all, uh, let's turn off the pin tool and also turn off uh, auto keyframe and auto uh, transition mode and add a keyframe for left, top and also transform origin. So if I have it all set, I can modify my transform origin to be, let's say, on the right bottom corner and now I can turn back on the pin tool, select another second of my animation and of course animate it out of, oops, sorry, animate that out of the stage. There you go. So if we play the whole thing from the beginning, you can see the ball nicely jumps into the stage and jumps back out of it. All right, so um, I hope that was helpful and you can expect more videos like this from me on um, Piotr on the Edge. Thank you very much and stay tuned and bye.